there's a school of thought that the timing of this move is, is coincidental to the ailment of the Prime Minister. For clarification, um, could you tell us if the sickness of Mr. Thompson has anything to do with this specific timing of this um, um, desire to have a change of leisure? Of well, I, uh, you uh, asked me to reflect on whether um, there is turmoil in the Democratic Labour Party of Mr. Thompson's illness and confusion and that. I, I don't think it is appropriate for me to try to get myself tangled up in the first of the Democratic Party. Well, but I have to be sure that well, you must about the decision to, to move Ms. Morley and to, to reinforce yourself. There's a school of thought out there that, 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 that this is time that if Ms. Thompson was fit and okay that this would not have occurred. Is that true or not? I don't know. Just ask me. From your perspective, not from the DLC's perspective. But let me just put it to you. I told you that I did not seek to be in here now. So let me get myself a bit here. That I did not seek to remove this money. My colleagues says, we think somebody else should be this and they have. Um, they have specific good reasons why they felt so. And believe me, it has nothing to do with Mr. Thompson's illness. But you can it just um, be arithmetical, <coughs> if you let me come in the area. That in the Labour Party, as far as I'm aware, has contested the number of elections with Mr. Thompson and beating Mr. Thompson over and over again. And I don't know, I don't know where you should be that a Labour Party would be terrorized or facing an election with Mr. Thompson. No, I'm, I'm so giving you the fact that I, I know what it is to, um, and then let me be candid with you, that the biggest electoral defeat in the history of Barbados, and uh, one of the biggest electoral defeats in the history of the Caribbean, was then Mr. Thompson led the Democratic Party gloriously. The 26 to 2 in 1999. So that uh, he lost in 19, um, um, 1994. The Empire Party lost in 2003. And I don't know why you feel that we are here shivering in our books, or we're shivering in our books at the prospect of having to face the election with David Thompson, having been in for his family. But so, um, I, want to, I want you to say that. Um, and the notion that we are here involving optimistic politics, you say, oh, not, not here. And I gave you the assurance that no matter who the leader of the Democratic Party is, and I know you are too experienced as a journalist to ask any person so I want him to start to get involved in speculation as well as when he quit things. But I'm not going to tell I'm too old for that. Um, but no matter who they are, we will be ready to face them and to take them on. And, and, and